in our contemporary society, what would we do without electricity? Probably nothing. Electricity is movement, light, energy. In one single word, electricity is life. But are we managing one of the most important things in our everyday life at best? Well, not at all. Nowadays, we use electricity in a very inefficient way, by alternating periods of peaks with periods of less power consumption, both in our houses and nationwide. Let's consider an average day of November 2012. In Italy, the peak recorded was 46 gigawatt, and the valley only 26. Peak load conditions should be avoided since they cause many problems. The worst of them are blackouts. New technologies enable new solutions. So do the smart grid and cyber physical systems, in which electric devices are becoming more and more intelligent thanks to embedded computers inside them. In our houses, many electric devices have access to a limited resource of the electric power. As computer scientists, we recognize that in our computers the same thing happens. Many programs have concurrently access to a limited resource of the computing power. So what about exploiting the same scheduling algorithms used to manage programs by our operating systems to schedule electric loads? What if home appliances could all be coordinated to reach a more stable electricity consumption? Everything becomes possible with an idea based on cyber-physical systems, the real-time physical systems. What is all about? Real-time physical systems, RTPS, study the application of real-time scheduling algorithms to switched physical systems and tell us how to assign the proper timing parameters to each electric device such that it can be managed by the scheduler together with other appliances. Let's see how this method might work in a small apartment. The activation of the washing machine is delayed, the refrigerator is preempted and resumed after a light is turned off, and the air conditioning activity is coordinated with the oven. Results, a peak load reduction of the 25%. Now, let's see what happens when we apply our method to a large set of a thousand air conditioning loads. If we use standard thermostatic controlled air conditioners, we obtain a very jagged power profile. Using our RTPS scheduler, the power profile is much flatter, the comfort in the rooms is preserved, and the peak load is reduced by the 30%. A flatter power consumption yields a much more efficient way to use energy with a possible increment in the use of less polluting sources of energy, lower costs, and overall, a greener planet.